into a deadly encounter in a suburban American neighborhood. Authorities say three teens dressed in black and wearing masks broke into a home in broad daylight, but then encountered one of the people who lived there armed with an AR-15. ABC's Clayton Sandell tonight. Police say it began when 23-year-old Zach Peters woke to the sounds of three masked teenage burglars breaking into this house near Tulsa, Oklahoma. Well, I thought it was thunder. It wasn't thunder, but gunfire. Police say Peters used an AR-15 rifle, opening fire and shooting all three burglars dead. Two are juveniles in the range of 16 to 17. One is an adult male, 18 years old. Two of the suspects we are considering armed. One was with brass knuckles, the other one was with a knife. Police say a fourth suspect, Elizabeth Rodriguez, turned herself in and is believed to have been the getaway driver. We're trying to clarify as to why they chose that house. Was it random or was there some other knowledge that the, the suspects had that they chose that house? Prosecutors say Oklahoma law allows for Rodriguez to be charged with three murders, even if she didn't pull the trigger. Those charges have not yet been filed. Oklahoma's Make My Day law allows homeowners to use deadly force in self-defense, but tonight prosecutors have not yet decided if Peters will face any charges.